Hey YouTube, opinionative reviewer here, bringing you guys a video on Corona 5.0.1 on Tether. Now basically what Corona does, it converts most, if not all, Tether jailbreaks for 5.0.1 to untethered jailbreaks. Now it supports the iPhone 4, iPad Touch 3rd gen, iPad Touch 4th gen, iPhone 3GS, and iPad 1. It does not work for iPad 2 or the iPhone 4S. Now I did a video earlier on the new Red Snow, you can go ahead and if you already jailbroken with Red Snow or you've tried this already and it did not work, you can go ahead and just watch that video, I'll put an annotation in this video and use that to jailbreak your device on Tether. Now why I'm doing this video is because I tried running my Red Snow jailbreak over my Snow Breeze jailbreak for 5.0.1 and it did not work, it was still tethered, but when I used Corona, I got my untethered jailbreak. So, all you have to do is go inside Cedia, open up your Cedia and search Corona. It should come up. As you see right there, you tap on it. You go ahead, you hit install. And then you confirm. It's going to install. You don't even have to reboot. But I suggest rebooting your device to see if it is, to see if it is tethered or untethered. So, I'm going to go ahead and reboot my device now so that you can see it is untethered. Just turn that off. And once again, if you're jailbroken with Red Snow already, you can go ahead and install this and see if it gives you an untethered jailbreak. If it doesn't give you an untethered jailbreak, use the new Red Snow and then run that jailbreak over your jailbreak. But this is mostly for Snow Breeze users if they tried re-jailbreaking with Red Snow and it didn't work. Please don't get confused. If anything is confusing, just go ahead and ask me a comment in the questions down below or even follow me on Twitter. I I reply a lot faster on Twitter than I do on the comments on YouTube. As you can see, my device isn't plugged in, and I'm rebooting it right now to show you guys that it is untethered. It's for 5.0.1, so if you're on iOS 5.0, go ahead and update before Apple releases 5.1. And make sure you save your SSS blobs. So there you go. My device has booted up, and... My device, my Cydia is opening, it's untethered. So that's basically it. If you guys have any questions, just go ahead and drop them down in the comments or follow me on Twitter. I answer my questions a lot faster there. With that being said, please rate, comment, subscribe. Have a nice day.